You know, what we have here is an anhydrous applicator, you know, a metering system, and um, not guy, the guys are not thinking about anhydrous right now, but they will again when prices go down and the mar margins are compressed. And so uh, what the, the big thing about this, the big feature about this, I should say, is that it has a, an actual pump. You know, when they're loading anhydrous tanks uh, from bulk, they have a pump. And I've always thought, well, why couldn't you pump it back to the applicator? Because in some cases, the, appli the applicator is wide enough or um, you're going fast enough now that anhydrous is just hard to move in that quantity. So it not only monitors it, but um, it, it uh, speeds up the process. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a metering system that meters it out. We pressurize the, the complete system so that we're raising the, uh, the pressure above tank pressure. That's how we're getting the extra volume out so that you can travel faster. Also, it makes sure that the anhydrous stays in liquid form. So as a liquid, it's much warmer because there's energy in it. It doesn't freeze up the openers on the bottom. Uh, so you run, even in cold weather, you can run without getting any dirt build up on your openers. What we have here is just an aid to help you stop the right place with your truck. And of course, now that a lot of guys have semis, you have to stop a pretty specific place to dump at your pit, at your farm, or even to load. And so um, on the side of your trailer, you put some DOT tape in a vertical, and then when, when you get close, it, it senses it and has a, a buzzer and a light. It's called the Sure Stop, and the price point's about $5.99. It comes with a bracket on the back to mount it to whatever you are. You can put it on a tripod that you would provide, and um, it just seems like it'd save a lot of clutch burning if you could just stop at the right place. You can put one to warn you and then one to stop you. Well, when I was walking by, I thought, um, well, there's a virtual rain gauge. Now, I wonder how that works. And so what they do is, uh, and we're going to do some on our farm just because it's nice to know in a precise location what it rained. And so they have a, an algorithm involving Doppler and rain intensity and things. And so they will actually uh, email me once a day how much it rains in these, these locations. It's about $10 a month per, per location. And you can get a, a monthly summary then for... Uh, 15 in total. Uh, is that 15 no matter how many sites you have mailed in so or emailed in so um, the thing that would be nice is of course if you're driving around trying to figure out uh, where to work when and uh, if you have irrigation of course that's imperative when you're scheduling. We have some other rain gauges here that are involved with the pivot telemetry so it'll be interesting to see how they all correspond and it'll just help us to know where to go when and how much to run pivots or not. All right, we're, we're here at the machinery show with Swivel Storage Solutions. And at first glance, it looks like a, a bench and drawers. And everybody needs those in their shop, and there's a lot of shops being built, and so it's a, a exciting time to go look at all that stuff. Well, this is a little different because uh, they have some solutions for the corners, and also once your drawers get really heavy, when you get all that stuff in them, uh, it's hard on the hinges and, and glides, and so uh, he's going to show us a little bit of the operation of the corner. It's like a Lazy Susan type, and so it goes clear around, store everything right there in the corner, and all of them are, are, are based on a uh, left, I guess, uh, either side hinge, and uh, some, of the, some of the drawers, you can just open one of those if you would. And so they look like a regular drawer front, and uh, they're pretty sturdy. He's, he's showing what, what you can do to have fun in the shop. And we have some other models. Of course, there's the small, small ones. And so uh, it's also kind of nice that when your drawers go back in, it, it isn't quite as prone to sliding the tools to the back. Here's a corner solution. Of course, here's uh, against the wall and then uh, 45 and back against the other, so you can set in the corner and has the, the same type of uh, solution. Uh, what makes this all work, of course, is the swivel, and uh, there's neoprene bushings in there. So they just work really smooth. The price point is about three to $500 a linear foot, and the way, reason that varies, of course, is the, the shelving, they just have stationary shelves, uh, are obviously different than small drawers or corner systems, so.